All right, hopefully this is the last adjustment I need to make on my end field here. Well, at least till I change handle or, or loads. I might go back to cast. I don't know. But when I'm playing with the front sights on any rifle, I like to try to get a base point. And I usually take usually take my caliper. And I'll measure where the front sight is. It's kinda hard to do with one hand. Well, I'll try my best. To just slide it down. All right, so. I'm gonna do it from the left side. Try it again. Okay, so I'm about 263,000. So usually I'll write that down, but I don't really have any paper with me, so two, six, three. So now I know something goes wrong, I can just put it back up there and start all over again. Most of the rifles, the Garands, Enfields, Mausers, Springfields, your average sight adjustment to change an inch at a hundred yards is going to be somewhere between six and eight thousandths to move in an inch. I'm trying to center my group up a little bit more and I need to go about an inch to the right. So that means this sight has to move to the left to move my impacts to the right. Front sight is opposite. You need to move right, you got to move your front sight left. If you need to bring your impacts up, the front sight has to go down. Rear sight is same, same. You need to go left, you move left, right, you go right, up is up, down is down. So I already figured out I need to move that about six thousandths. So I'm already at two six three. So I would need two five seven. So I would move this, I would move my caliper until it says two five seven. And then lock it, and then you just use it as a gauge. You can see it's not quite touching. It's hard to see on the camera. So, with my trusty punch, a little hammer. This is just a plastic sight now, so it moves real easy, but it seems to be holding still. It doesn't move under recoil, but we'll see. If it moves, it's going to move in a match. It's um, enough for this because I'm just going to knock it over and try to get to the range Monday or Tuesday and put 10 rounds down and see where she hits.